Hey guys, so today's plan with me will be pretty short because the upcoming week will be quite chill for me. Um, to start off, I want to thank all 40 plus of you for subscribing. I'm not sure what I was expecting when I decided to start the channel, but I didn't really expect that anyone but my friends would subscribe because my iMovie skills still suck, my desk isn't the prettiest, I don't exactly have the nicest voice and I don't even put music in my videos. It's not unintentional because I wanted to produce something less um, aesthetic, you know? So given my current skill level, I'd be overreaching myself anyway. A clean desk is possible, maybe for an Instagram photo, but definitely not for a video. And I like the relative authenticity. Also, I think it's illegal to rip music off the internet for such users. So yeah, I started this channel thinking of making real homemade videos without aspiring towards studio level quality. But seriously though, thank you all for caring and hitting subscribe. It really warms my heart. So to get on with today's plan with me, um, this week I did not use the same pink Tombow brush marker as I did last week. Last week's was number 772, which is my favourite. So this week's is 723. It's, um, it's a little brighter than 772, but I thought that maybe I needed a little colour to brighten up my week. Does that make sense? <laughs> yeah. And I didn't use the Pigma Micron either because I didn't have a lot of things to cram into my page. So I just used my normal Sarasa black pen. Yep. For the the dance days, I used the um, Pentel Fude Sign Pen in medium. Out of all the sizes that the Pentel... Um, Fude sign pen comes in. I like the medium one the best because when you press down, the down strokes can get really fat. So the difference between the your down strokes and your up strokes um, becomes really distinct. Also, I don't know if you've noticed, but instead of printing photos and sticking them in my bujo, I don't really do that. I try to fill up the page the best I can with washi tape. Because I think that printing photos is so... It's like a cop-out. <laughs> it's so bad to say, but I do think it's a cop-out. And I bought so much washi tape. It'd be a waste if I didn't use it. Or if I were to put it in Singlish, got by means must use. I usually put important things in boxes. So like I have a term paper due on Wednesday, so I put it there. But for Thursday, I wasn't sure what I was going to do yet. So I just drew a box and... I when plans pop up, I'll just put them there. It seems like all I do is go for dance classes, but actually this week is an exception. Yeah, it's because I, I don't have any more work shifts until August. So since I'm going to be free, I might as well spend my time improving. Another regular thing that I have in my um, bujo is dinner plans with my friend Jen. But once her internship ends next week, mm, I'm not so sure anymore. Maybe we'll have lunch instead. Something I haven't put into my bujo yet is a doctor's appointment that I have because I think I might have a ganglion cyst in my right wrist so I might get surgery to remove it because it, you can't really like get rid of it with medication. And I also have to reschedule my um, tattoo appointment. So hopefully that will be on Thursday or Friday. Yes, I'm very excited about it. So when all the important things are filled up, then I will usually just draw plants all over my page. I really, really love plants. I have like um, maybe 20 different kinds of plants in my room just my room alone because my house does not have a garden or a balcony so I try my best to keep plants in my room by the window underneath a light that I had installed. I 
think it's good that I'm good with plants because at my workplace, we sell a lot of plants. But it seems like the other part-timers don't really care about them. So they don't get water and they don't get sunlight. And then they die and then my boss just replaces them. But it's such a waste, you know? Oh, by the way, my favorite highlighter right now, as you can tell from this video and the last, is the Stabilo Pastel Pink um, highlighter. I really like how it looks on paper, even though it kind of pulls at the end. But if you swipe up your highlighter really, really fast, then you can maybe like avoid that. But I thought it looks really, really good. I really like this shade of pink and it reminds me of candy. And another thing is that um, this video recording of me doing my bojo is being played back at four times the speed. So um, this page actually took me just slightly under half an hour because I think it helps to just sit there and think about the week to come. It really helps me consolidate what I need to do. I'm not really sure how long people usually take to do their bujo, but because I, I like to put in a lot of details and washi tape, that takes time to cut. So the time taken to do my bujo is definitely not 10 minutes. So we've come to the end of the video, and for the next video, I was thinking of making an instructional sort of tutorial on how to source for things on cheap and... Um, good websites like AliExpress, um, probably not Taobao because my Mandarin really sucks. But yeah, um, we'll see. So, bye guys.